Hey y'all, it's my third week on Wegovi and I'm gonna show you what I ate this week to lose weight. First, I'm gonna get some food prep done to make it easier to throw together some of my meals during the week, and then I'll show you some recipes. This week I made chicken fajitas, pork tenderloin with air fryer potatoes and steamed cabbage, and I'm repurposing my fajita leftovers into a yummy salad. If you're interested in a detailed calorie and macro breakdown on everything I ate this week, I'll leave a link in the description to my fitness pal profile where you can view my food diary. I post cooking and results videos every week, so if any of these recipes sound good to you, be sure to give the video a like and hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you don't miss any of my content. I hope you enjoy the video. So we're just doing some really easy meal prep today. Just getting the eggs hard boiled for my egg salad this week. Gonna pre-cook all my bacon and then I'm gonna prep some fruit. And lastly, I'm gonna cut up the veggies for the fajitas this week. And that's it. I'm not even sure if I can call this a recipe y'all because I just use pre-marinated meat from the grocery store. If you have something like that in your area, I definitely recommend it. It's just a huge time saver. So with my veggies, I just add them to the pan drippings from cooking the chicken and then I'm going to season them up with some salt, a little bit of black pepper, some garlic powder cumin coriander oregano Mexican oregano is best if you can find it and then some hot sauce and that's it just go ahead and toss these up until they get good and brown, and then you're done. You're not there, miss. Yeah, you might not be at your best, but it's fine. I don't mind telling truths when you need to hear them. And be kind when that's what.
what you prefer How about when you can't see a way out Help you fight And let you know that It won't always be this way mm -hmm. You will get there someday, babe Feel the sun on your face Visit Paris or Broadway Hey y'all! I'm gonna have to look into what's going on with my camera. The footage for this recipe just disappeared. This was the Instant Pot pork tenderloin with the air fried potatoes and steamed cabbage. I'm gonna link all the recipes down in the description but again I'm so sorry. I will say that this pork tenderloin was not cooked all the way through so when you follow the recipe make sure you add a few minutes onto the cooking time. Anyway, I really hope you guys try this one out. I'm just, again, I'm so sorry about the missing footage, but here's the finished product. I really enjoy finely shredded cabbage on my fajita salads and also my tacos. So if you've never tried it, I definitely recommend it. Um, you can do this with a knife. I just really like how thin the mandolin gets it. I get my produce containers at TJ Maxx and Home Goods. They do a really good job of keeping your produce fresh for longer. Good grief! Good I told me. There we go. Just hold on a minute, this part is Normally this is something I would do during food prep at the beginning of the week. It's just for whatever reason I didn't get that done. So that makes it really easy. These produce containers will keep them fresh for a really long time. And then you can just grab a couple handfuls of lettuce and throw your salad together in a matter of minutes. If you've never seen these avocado keepers before, I found them at TJ Maxx and Home Goods. They are awesome. There's my chicken fajita taco salad. I'm gonna eat it. Breakfast this week were really simple. Some of the mornings I did two fried eggs with chicken sausage and toast, and the other mornings I did bacon, egg, and cheese quesadillas with fruit.
All right, guys, that's it for this week. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and let me know in the comments which recipe you're planning to try. If you're interested in seeing how much weight I lost this week, be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you know as soon as my results video goes up later this week. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.